morning, welcome back to my channel. I have a really fun video for you guys, something I do every year, it's kind of become a tradition on my channel. And so this video is what we got our seven year old daughter for her birthday. When I'm filming this video, she is still technically six, so hopefully I will not keep going back and forth and saying six year old, seven year old, but she will be turning seven this month and so these are the things that we have purchased for her for her birthday so i love watching videos like these on youtube it gives you such a great idea of what is out there in the world of toys and gifts for kids and especially when you have kids that maybe you don't know what to buy for or you have a child that maybe has a lot already and you want to still find something unique that they're going to like i love watching videos like this i hope you find it helpful and i will link everything that i am going to show in the description box below so you can check out more information on pricing and just more details about the item itself if you're interested. But like I said, she's turning seven, so it's a really fun age because it's getting to that point where she's getting to be a big girl and liking more beauty things and fun jewelry and accessories and things like that. So it's a really fun age right now, and I had a great time shopping for these gifts for her. So the first thing I'm gonna show you is something you may have already seen. Everything else you ha I haven't showed you yet, but this I did actually show in my non-electronic gift guides for kids video I did back in December. I shared this Klutz glitter face painting book. And I mentioned in that video, and I've mentioned in many other videos, how much we love Klutz books. If you don't know what Klutz is, it's just a children's book publisher that has tons of different crafty type books activities and things like that so they have like make your own glitter charms and make your own uh, pom-pom kittens and stuff like that so this one is one of their newer ones it came out last year but it is one of their newer ones and it is glitter face painting so it comes with everything you need to make like all these really pretty designed um different face face designs so they've got like a cupcake princess which is really cute and this one on the back is a unicorn i think it's something really fun to give a little girl that loves to dress up and loves face painting or if you're having a birthday party and you don't know what to do for the girls at the birthday party i think this would be a fun thing to pick up for a party and do face painting yourself for all the kids that come so i think she's really going to love that and i'm excited to give her that so sticking along the lines of makeup you know like i said when they're six seven eight usually they start getting involved in makeup and little things like that and so she actually wanted this because her older sister had it it is the fashion angels makeup artist sketch set and so basically you get all these different pages with little doll like little models on them and you can use the makeup that comes in the kit to do the little paper like it's like paper dolls but for makeup so you can use all the makeup and colors that come in the kit to do lip gloss and eyeshadow and blush and all different kinds of neat things like the hair colors up here like little streaks of hair and like I said, my oldest daughter has this same set from like a couple years ago and my youngest daughter always wanted to play with it. So she has her own kit and I think most little girls love playing with makeup and I think it's just a really fun way for them to do that without making a mess on themselves. So I think she's really going to be excited to have her own of that. Pretty much any time I get a chance, I like to squeeze a little bit of Disney in anything we do. And so no exception to that is for her birthday, I got the Disney I Found It game. She really loves playing board games. And I hate board games. I've always been like jokingly said they call them board games for a reason because I just hate games. I don't really know. I don't like video games. I don't like board games, but I don't mind looking for things. Like I don't, I like word searches and like those find it type games. My youngest daughter is obsessed with those books that you get that have like all the hidden pictures. She loves those things. And we've given her those over the years for different gifts and she loves them. So this is like that, but in a game form. And so there's 12 different Disney realms that you can explore and you have to go through and find all these hidden objects before the time runs out. Um, and the first person to get to the castle before the time is up, I guess, wins based on what it says on the back. So I thought it would be really fun for us to play. It's got a six foot game board. And I just thought it's going to be a really fun game for us to play together as a family. And of course, it's Disney, so anything Disney is a hit with us all the time. So I'm really excited for her to have that because she does love those, those hidden type things and it's Disney. So I think it's a great marriage of those two and I'm excited for her to have that. The next thing that um, where she's going to get, and actually I guess I did mention this in the non-electronic gift guide and I had forgotten until just now. And it is the Complete Sticker Maker Set. So for kids, what they get to do is they have all these different color pages that you color and then you put it through this little machine and it makes anything into a sticker. So you don't have to have these pages. So once you run out of the pages that come with the kit, your child can draw whatever they want. They can draw their name, whatever they want to do. As long as it fits in this little machine, they can make it into a sticker. 
Again, my oldest daughter has this from a couple years ago. She got it for Christmas. My youngest daughter always wanted one because my oldest daughter has one and she loves hers. And so I got her her own. This one is, I think, the deluxe kit. Yeah, the extreme sticker maker kit. So it comes with extra tape and some other things that maybe the other kit didn't come with. And it even comes with a sticker journal. So if they want to put all the stickers that they make um, in a special place, there's a sticker journal for that as well. So the next thing that we got her is the Little Lockets jewelry kit. And basically, if you know what Origami Owl is, it's like those pendants that are clear and open on the inside and you can open them up and put little uh, floating charms on the inside. Um, my oldest daughter has one, I have one, and so my youngest daughter has always wanted one. So I got her this because it's like a kid version of that. So you get all these different little charms that come in the box, like you can get make into necklaces or bracelets, as you can see right here, she's got a bracelet on. Um, but basically the little locket pops open and you can get different kits like this is the sweets kit so all the little charms are like ice cream and what else a donut a little piece of cake a milkshake cupcakes so they put the little charms inside the locket and then they shake around in there and it's really cute and like i said you can make it to a keychain a bracelet or a necklace so I thought she would really like that. They have like a pets version, the sweets version, a rock star version, I think. But I got the sweets one because I thought it was really cute. The last thing I'm really trying to decide, I'm going to give her for her birthday or not. And I, when I bought all this stuff, I had not planned on getting this other thing. And so now I'm kind of conflicted about what I should do because, like I said, she really wanted one of those origami owl necklaces. And... So I'm trying to decide because I actually ended up getting her one. It's not the actual Origami Owl brand. It's the one from Kohl's called Blue LaRue. It's the same brand my oldest daughter has. And I I don't know because if I give her this, isn't that kind of like the one I just showed only better? I don't know. But this is what it looks like. So as you can see, it is a little charm, like a little locket. I'm going to try to turn it upside down so you can see it. This one came with little beads, some little gemstones, and a little heart bead already in it. But, you know, she can pop it open and get new beads and uh, switch them out for the holidays or the seasons or whatever. And when my oldest daughter got hers a couple years ago, I gave her the necklace. But then I also gave her, like, a little certificate that I made up that she could go and pick a couple charms um, from this website. This Etsy shop, actually, um, where I usually get my charms. And that she could go pick a couple charms for her necklace. So now I don't know what to do because I have this, which is like the little kid version of this. So I don't know, should I give her both of these or should I just take this back and give her this one? I don't know what to do. So I haven't decided yet if I'm gonna give her this for her birthday or maybe Valentine's Day or maybe in her Easter basket. But I wanted to share it anyway, just in case you have a little girl that maybe would love to have an origami owl necklace, but maybe you don't want to spend quite the money on it. This was much cheaper because it was from Kohl's.com. I thought for it was $40 and then I had a coupon. There was two coupons that I used on top of that. So I ended up paying $20 for this. And I thought that was a great price because it's stainless steel. It came with a necklace, the locket, the little beads, and then one charm. So for $20, I thought that was a great deal. But I just can't decide I want to give it to her for her birthday, for Easter, Valentine's Day. I don't know. I think it's super cute and sparkly and something that any little girl would love. So whether or not I give her that for her birthday yet, I haven't decided. But it's a great gift idea, I think, for any little girl. So that is what we're giving our 7-year-old for her birthday. Everything that I showed you guys will be in the links. I will have links for it in the description box below. Make sure you check out those links if you would like to purchase those things. So I hope this video was helpful. I really enjoy making these videos. My oldest daughter will be 13 next month. So what I got her for her birthday will be coming up in a couple weeks. I'll be sharing that with you guys. Um, so make sure you stay tuned for that. Don't forget to like this video if you liked it. Let me know what you think I should do about the necklace, the necklace and the necklace kit. What do you think I should do about that? And make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any of my videos. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.